Good morning, children. I hope so. You all are fine. Busy with your studies. Good. Don't waste your time, children. But you need to give most of your time in your studies because you have to do it with all the four subjects. So this is the topic which I am taking. This is for standard one. Maths mixed word problem means addition and subtraction both. You have the worksheet and you have done the worksheet also, but the thing is that I have not taught you how to write the statement for word problem. So this I am going to explain it. How will you catch the question? And how will you write the statement? So, now you focus on the board. A farmer had seven oxen and two donkeys. So, he had seven oxen and two donkeys. There are two kinds of animals with him. How many animals does he have in all? Now this word in all means what? In all means all together. Combine it. In all means you have to add it. Okay? So do you understand? Did you understand the question children? A farmer had seven oxen and two donkeys. So how many does he have a lot? Now how will you begin to write the sentence? Now look. A farmer had seven oxen. This is first sentence. And we are going to write the statement from right from the beginning till here. Leave this and. So seven oxen. That means he has many oxen. So we are going to begin the statement with number of oxen who had a farmer had. So you need to write the whole thing. Number of oxen a farmer had. So how many oxen does he have? Seven. So you write the number here is equal to seven. Now the next thing what we are talking about is about the donkeys. So how many donkeys does he have? He has got two donkeys. So again we are going to begin the sentence with number of. Number of means many. More than one. So number of donkeys a farmer had. Who had? A farmer had. You need to write the full statement. Is equal to two. Now the third pattern. What is it asking? means you have to put together and add it. By all these, looking at this word, you will find out that you have to add. Okay? So, therefore, put three dots like this. Total animals in all. In the question itself, you have the answer. The thing is that how are you going to put the answer? It should be short. This is not English. It can be short. You shorten the sentence and then write. Total animals in all is equal to, now you see the word what I have done here. 7 plus 2. Now most of you all what you do when I was doing the correction you forget to give the sign. This is very very important. If there is no sign, how will I know whether you have added or whether you have subtracted? I won't be knowing. So you need to put, this is very important sign you have to put. So 7 plus 2. When you add it, you will get 9. And then after that you write ALS answer is equal to 9. 9 what? We are talking about animals. How many animals? So you need to write 9 animals. And please underline it with your blue color pencil. I hope so.
so you all have understood we go to the next question chapter now question number 2 Thank you. 